Crypto Activator here and welcome back to another video. In this video, I wanna go over a strategy that I'm personally using myself to stake Matic on the Polygon network and get a pretty good decent APR at the same time. So if you wanna learn a great strategy for staking Matic on the Polygon network, you're gonna to wanna to watch through this video. So let's get started. Okay, before we begin, get started and really dig into this, let me first remind you that this isn't financial advice. This is crypto, this is DeFi. You need to do your own research when it comes to crypto and DeFi and make your own decisions with building your portfolio and yield farming with DeFi. Okay, so here we are on Stater Labs website. What we're gonna do is we're going to stake some Matic tokens on the Polygon network. Now, the thing about this with staking Matic is, Matic is a token that I believe I want to be holding. I believe that this is a great project, Polygon Matic, okay? And this token is going to do very well. Now, that's my personal belief, my own opinion, you come up with your own decision and your own opinion on whether you believe the token is good or not, all right? But I think it's a pretty good token that it's one that I want to hold. I want to hodl this token. I want to hold it. I want to stack this token. I want to keep it for the long term, right? Now, when I'm talking long term, I'm talking like the next year or two, couple years, really, throughout this market cycle, okay? Throughout the up and coming bull market with crypto here, okay? So in other words, I'm not planning on selling this right away. I'm not selling my Matic over the next few months or even within the next year, to year or so, okay? I wanna hold it for a bit. So because I'm gonna hold it for a bit, for a little while, I might as well earn a yield on it, right? And this yield that I'm gonna get, well, it's not degen yields, right? This is not a cash flow play where I'm looking at generating a, uh, a very huge degen daily APR that I'm going to get lots of cash flow every day. No, the yield's going to be much smaller than the degen play, of course, right? But because I'm going to hold this token, I plan on holding it anyways. Well, instead of just holding it and earning nothing, I might as well stake it at the same time, right? And if it goes up or it goes down, well, that doesn't matter because I plan on hodling and holding for the long term anyways. And there's no impermanent loss either with this strategy. This is a strategy that I'm personally using as well, by the way. Here's what we're looking at. We've got Stater, we've got Matic X right here. It's all on the screen and you might be looking at this and you're seeing, well, 4.74%. You're right, that's not a very huge return. Well, that's just the start. That's just the beginning. That's where we are going to start off with, okay? I'm going to show you we're gonna get a little bit more than that, okay? We're not getting DGEN, but we're gonna get a little bit better than 4.74, okay? So I like to compare this to a car dealership. Uh, what do you mean? Well, we're participating in liquid staking here. What is liquid staking? Well, I like to compare that with a car dealership. You know, when you bring your vehicle back to the dealership to get serviced, they don't just leave you with nothing. Right? They give you a loaner vehicle that you can take that loaner vehicle and you can drive it around. You're not without a vehicle. You can do whatever you need to do right? with that loaner vehicle until your vehicle is done. You bring the loaner vehicle back and you get your vehicle back in return. Right? Pretty cool, right? That's how it works. Right? And so that's similar to liquid staking. So what we're going to do is we bring our Matic tokens into the dealership, the stater labs and we stake our Matic tokens so that they can be used in validators and they can be staked and earn their yield but they don't leave us with nothing. They we're going to earn our yield by staking them but then they're also going to give us a loaner token, right? Pretty cool, right? So this loaner token is called Matic X. We give Matic, they give us back Matic X. Now, we still have control of this because we can come back anytime we want. This is all done with smart contracts through DeFi, okay? This is not no centralized staking here. We bring, we can come back with our Matic X and exchange it back for our Matic tokens anytime we want. And whenever we do, we will receive back this 4.74% rewards from our tokens that we had left staked with Matic or with Stater, that is, right? Make sense? Cool. 
So what could we do with these Matic X tokens when we receive them, these loaner tokens? Well, we can do what we want with them, right? We can just keep them, let them sit there in our wallet and receive our 4.74% rewards. Or we could also take those Matic X tokens, go over and participate in another DeFi protocol, DeFi ecosystem, and earn even more rewards, more yield, right? Pretty cool, right? I know you're getting that. Okay, so check this out. This is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna walk you through this and show you the next couple of steps and how this really works, okay? All right, first, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go over and we're gonna click on where it says stake now. Okay, so now here we are inside on the dashboard of this protocol, Stater Labs, and we're going to stake our Matic tokens. So of course we need to have our wallet connected. So we'll make sure that our wallet is connected with MetaMask here, right? Got my demo wallet all set up here. So now it is, it's connected. And what you're gonna do is you're just gonna enter the amount. I've only got three in this demo wallet, but let's take for example, we've got 1000 tokens. We're gonna type it in here and we're going to click stake. Boom, just like that. And once we do, we've got it staked. And when we wanna come back and unstake them, we can come back here and go unstake and it will give us back our Matic tokens by returning our Matic X tokens. Make sense? Pretty cool, it's pretty simple. I mean, it doesn't get any easier than that, right? You click your button and that's it, simple. But now we've got those Matic X tokens, okay? So now we're gonna take our Matic X and we're gonna to go and use another DeFi protocol and earn even more yield. We're gonna go over here where it says DeFi and we're gonna click on DeFi. Okay, here we are. We've got several different options here, okay? You've got automated leverage staking, okay? You've got your liquidity pools, you've got your stater pools, you've got lending and borrowing, you've got some more yield optimizers, you've got some option tradings and vaults, several different options you can choose from here right, other DeFi protocols, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make this really simple and we are going to just provide liquidity on another DEX, okay? And the DEX we're going to choose is right here, Balancer, okay? And it's showing 11% for APR, okay? And what we wanna do now that we choose this, you see this says Matic X and Matic, okay? Well, now we've staked all our Matic and we got just Matic X. That's okay, don't worry about it. Watch this, okay? We're gonna go over here and you see where it says add liquidity? We're going to click add liquidity. Okay, here we are now on Balancer. This is a DEX, an AMM, all right? And what we're gonna do is we are going to provide liquidity for these tokens and we're going to earn a yield. Okay, so we're gonna scroll down and you'll see the APR, it says 8%. Uh, Maybe it was 11, maybe it was eight. I think this is really more accurate in what it is, what it changes. This is not like it's a set APR. It's not going to be set at this all the time. It will fluctuate. It can go down to like seven and a half, it can go up to nine, it can go up to 12. It will fluctuate, but you're getting more. Obviously you see you're getting more on top of that 4.74%. We're now getting into the double digits when you add them both together, even with eight and four, right? So it's still not a bad APR when you add them together and better than like just holding on to Matic, right? Okay, so if you wanna hover your mouse over here, you can see the breakdown. You'll see the breakdown you've got, it says a total 8% and here's the breakdown. You got 0 0.04 for the swap fees APR. You've got a boosted APR and you've got your 1.48 Matic X APR and then you've you know on top of what you're getting as well from being staked in stater okay and then you've got 6.14 for your staking APR okay so you've got that breakdown right here and then when you scroll down here a little bit more you will see this is the actual total composition of what is being or what's in this pool like what you are staking so you're gonna stake your Matic X a single token but then it's going to be broken up into few different tokens here, which is all still Matic, okay? It's all Matic, so that's why I say, whether the token value goes up or down, it doesn't matter. 
There's no impermanent loss here. It's all the same thing. But you've got a wrapped Matic, and here's your Matic X. Now, this is the really good thing, is your majority is still in Matic X. So it balances them all out, right? What we're gonna do is we're gonna now add our liquidity into these, into these tokens, okay? So you see where it says add liquidity? We'll click add liquidity now. Okay, now here we are on the page where you are going to stake them. Going here, it says single token staking, right? So you can pick any of these tokens, but we wanted to stake them liquid staking first, and then we're gonna add it to this, right? So what did we have here, right? Well, we had Matic X, right? So we would go and we look for Matic X, and then we're going to add what our, you know, what we have, whether it was a thousand or what, right? We're gonna add them in here providing this liquidity and you'll see then it gets broken up into these tokens right that are in that pool so it's just it's really that simple so we'll go back here and then once you have them staked you will be able to see right up here where it says portfolio you can click on portfolio and you will see your staked pools okay another thing that you can go and take a look at is right here where it says claim click claim and this is where you will see your rewards, where you are able to claim them. You can claim your rewards now anytime you want, once a day, twice a day, once a week, twice a week, whenever you want, you can come and claim your rewards while your Matic X is staked, while you are continuing to earn your rewards, okay? So you can have your token staked for the next year or two while you want it to hold them anyways, and then just collect these rewards, right? Pretty cool. That's why I like this, okay? So that's it. That's, that's, it's really that simple to do. Well, there you go. That's the strategy for staking Matic tokens on the Polygon network using liquid staking and balancer to provide liquidity. All right. If you plan on holding Matic tokens anyways, and you know, you want to get some yield by staking them while you hold through this market cycle and into the up and coming bull market, Hey, why not, right? Well, this is my personal strategy. This is what I'm personally doing with Somatic as well. And if you at all found any value in this content, you, you found it helpful, you know what to do. I'd very much appreciate it if you did. Smash that like button, drop me a comment down below. It really would help with the YouTube algorithm as well. And I'd be curious, I'd like to know, are you gonna utilize this staking strategy yourself? right and if you are enjoying any of the content that i am putting out here and you have not yet subscribed well again you know what to do click subscribe click the bell so you're notified when new videos are released for your viewing and in fact i should have another video pop up right about here that i believe youtube's even recommending for you so go head on over there check out this video i'll see you over there in the meantime, you have a great day. Bye for now.